Days of Sport with me, Beefy. And Rob. And Rob, what are we doing today? It's handball time. We're going handballing up into the north. The idea here, you see, everyone's about football, aren't they? All the games about foot, AR, ARL, AFL, it's yeah. football, soccer football, yeah. American football, football. Yeah. Everything's football. No, no more feet. We want hands. That's right. It's all hands. We're going handball. And Rob, uh, what's your extensive knowledge about handball? I used to play it when I was at intermediate school, and um, oh. uh, and uh, it's when there's like a four square, yeah. and you have a tennis ball, right. and you bounce it into your own square, and then oh. on the, and you sort of play a game, and that's it, isn't it? No, not this one. That must be New Zealand handball. We're not doing that? No, not this week. Oh. Today is a uh, a trial match for the Australian team mm. who are preparing for the Olympic qualifying tournament. Okay, so you ready to roll? Yeah, let's handball. Handball it. Three hundred sixty-five days of sport with Jason Hopner, the Australian women's handball coach. Jason, this is a bit of a warm-up for the uh, World Championship qualifiers. Uh, yes, it is. Yes, so uh, the girls are departing in about uh, what is it, about two and a half weeks from now uh, to Kazakhstan. Oh, Kazakhstan. We, yes, competing against uh, Congo, Kazakhstan, and the whoever comes fourth place in the current Pan American Championships, which oh, okay. are underway. So, so yes. uh, are you confident, or where are we at uh, realistically with the Australian team? Uh, oh, look, I mean, uh, the girls are well prepared. We've been doing uh, training camps on a monthly basis, so um, they're as fit and as, uh, as ready as they're ever going to be. And yourself, uh, how long have you been involved with handball? Uh, geez, turning 40 this year, so uh, about 25 years. Yeah. So I was a, um, played with the national team for a number of years yep. and uh, played overseas as well professionally, which was oh, a really? great experience. Yeah. But uh, the last five years has uh, predominantly been coaching, okay. so that's yeah. been a nice change. So the next three weeks so you've got today as a kind of uh, few warm-up games and see how the girls go. And yeah. what's, what's the schedule like for the next three weeks then before you go? Uh, the girls go back to their respective states, um, continue training, uh, jump on a plane, a couple of days preparation in Kazakhstan, and then it's uh, one, two, three games so in three days. So oh, three games in three, three days. Games in three right. days. Yeah, yeah. No, no rest. So uh, it's going to be tough. Yeah, thanks. All right, no worries at all. Luck today. Best of luck in Kazakhstan. Thank you very much. And we are here with Boris Jovanovic, a star handball player. I understand you spent a bit of time up in uh, Europe playing, yeah, is that correct? Yes, Norway. Professionally? Uh, second division, not really that professional. Do they pay you? No. Nah. No money? Being the goal there, that's your, that's your, your full-time position? Yes, it is. How did you end up there? Uh, accident. Yeah. Uh, I played soccer all my life, had some knee operations, and uh, stopped for about two years, came to handball, through a friend. Originally playing on the court, we didn't have a goalkeeper, so I went in goals and saved a few shots and uh, enjoyed it ever since. We are here with uh, Lucas. He's just come off a pretty vigorous effort out there. How did, how did your form go? Oh, yeah, the team played really well. Um, 
these boys are actually trying to go to Qatar for super, uh, for super globe yep. so they're just having a practice match against us and uh, yeah they they've got a great team and we just tried to play the best we could really you look a bit worse for word there did you, did you have a late night by any chance or anything like uh, it's my birthday today so last night we've just been yeah a bit yeah. drinking yeah. 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 you know and yeah it shows today <laughs> what time did you wrap up I uh, wrapped it up at 8.30 this morning. 8.30? Uh, Does the coach know? Or? Yeah, yeah, it's my mum. <laughs> <laughs>
It is, it is. But before we go, we should mention, now it's getting near crunch time for our almighty 365-day venture. Yeah. And we do have a crowdfunding appeal yeah. pledge out there. So check the uh, address of the crowdfunding uh, site here. Um, and any support, any help you can give us, greatly appreciated. Greatly appreciated. And set us on our way. Until then, farewell. See you soon. All right, and here we're, we're one more time, and we are here with uh, Lucas. He's just—it's a quite hard playing because, like Thursday, obviously Thursday's a big night. You have a few beers, you get stuck in. Friday, a few more big ones. Saturday, triple header. Then you're gonna come out here on a Sunday and play. Is that a pretty tough preparation? Yeah, definitely, man. Definitely, we like it. We like the preparations for these little games that we have. It's good. I didn't examine the Chico rolls either. See what the hell oh, I don't think you missed that. <laughs> uh, missed anything.